Hello friends, today we are going to learn how to make an object empty or how to make an object fully transparent that you can also see the background. So how this is possible? Let's begin our tutorial. So let's begin our tutorial. First of all, I am using my crop tool to resize the image or place it perfectly. Then when you, when you think this one is completed, then just adjust the size of your image. Click on Content Aware, then press OK. Now your image is perfectly placed. Then go to your background layer, right click and make duplicate layer. Press OK. The duplicate layer is completed. Then you select the or you select the glass, then take pen tool for selection. Then zoom in the image by pressing Ctrl or Command plus then hold space to readjust the image then start your selection take little bit time to make your selection perfect and clear pen tool helps you to select perfectly in carved areas so i recommended you for selection, pen tool is my first choice. Just hold control and carve the line. Same process, just hold control and carve the line. Take a time for your selection. When you complete the selection, right click and make selection then ok. Your selection is complete. Then press Ctrl plus V. That's make your copy of your selected image. Then go to quick selection tool and select your glass object. Then click on main layer or lower layer. Then go to selection, modify and expand make 3 percent expand size press ok then go to edit and go to then go to edit and fill and content aware this is this is one of this process and another process in 2019 is go to directly or uh, the second one process is go to directly edit and content aware field you can directly see the live vision of content aware you can see that the glass object is removed then just press ok ok now go to selection select and deselect this is your image with full background and there is no glass in your image select your glass image and lower image then merge both the layer then again visible your glass layer select your glass layer duplicate your glass layer by right click and duplicate layer ok then hide the first glass object and go to filter and camera row filter go to HSL adjustment 
means hue saturation and luminance adjustment then decrease the yellow light and also decrease the orange color and also decrease red color but little bit decrease then press ok then take a mask layer just click on mask layer ok then make sure your, your foreground color is black and take a brush tool then adjust the opacity of your brush take a soft brush hardness 20 or 10% then use your masking brush on your glass object Then go to new layer and use brush tool, make foreground color white, opacity 100%. Then add some extra white light to make your transparency original. Hold shift, hold shift, then drag a line. Then adjust the opacity of your brush. Then click on masking layer. Then go to mask layer and brush to make opacity 20% to 25% <coughs> then again use and then again apply masking on your brush line Then again take a new layer, go to paint tool, make some line, Then make selection, then go to fill adjustment layer and take solid color. This one is white, then press OK. Then adjust the opacity of your color. Just adjust the opacity of your color. Now this this looks better this looks better almost the image color and your layer color is matches then again apply masking layer make opacity little bit make opacity 25% and foreground color black and apply the masking
when you think this one is completed then press move tool or right click on complete tool then again do the same process for your little bit white effect Then last one, this is the main adjustment that you have to do in, in this work, size, light, okay. just drag a line then add clipping mask layer, yeah. it's look great, then go to your glass object, make foreground color white, add brush tool and add little bit masking, removing tool. Now your work has been done and it's look completely transparent and look great. So I think you like this tutorial and if you like this tutorial please subscribe my channel. Okay thank you and goodbye. See you again with a new tutorial.